You show convincingly that、uh, systematic review is much more sought after compared with narrative review. So I have two questions. First, what's the place for narrative review now? Yeah,、uh-huh. Well, there are certain topics that cannot be studied with a systematic review, and I think things are things like what's in the pipeline for a field, or there may be、uh, areas where you genuinely need someone's opinion. But I think you have to be careful then, as a medical writer, to be completely clear that it is the opinion of the author that you're expressing, and not the opinion of、uh, of the writer. You need to let, make sure that the、um, author can take the lead.、Uh, okay.、Uh, my second question is: Are they good systematic review and the bad systematic review? Uh, well, I think the, the the easiest thing to say is there are、uh, profitable systematic reviews and there are unprofitable systematic reviews, because the danger is you could end up trying to review the whole of Medline. So、uh, that's a flippant answer, but it actually leads to a serious point, which is a good systematic review has a very clear research question to answer, just as any study would. You should not be doing a systematic review on a disease. You should be doing a systematic review to understand how a disease affects patients, or to understand how common it is, or to understand、uh, maybe something about the unmet need, for instance. So the key to a good systematic review is a good research question. I hope that helps. Yes. Chris, catch you. Thank you very much. Thank you.